All right, y'all. So this is the next video. So we got the another car that we're going to be showing y'all today. So last video we did the C8 Corvette. Today we're gonna do the new supercar, the Lampadati Tigan. Okay, I believe that's how you pronounce it. So this is going to probably go in another arena war. So I'm not exactly sure what car this is based off in real life, but it does look pretty sick. From first impressions, it looks like it's going to be similar to the Wagner. You know, similar performance of the Wagner, similar turning, all that. So, I'll see y'all when it gets there, when it finally arrives, okay? And I'll see y'all in a little bit. Don't run me over! Okay. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Alright guys, so now the Tiger finally has arrived, so I'm going to call this then the mechanic real quick. I said that pretty funny. Mechanic. Alright, so here we go. We're by, right by a uh, customization shop, so wheels? I'm going to call that I'm real Johnny quick. It's called the Tiger. See, I still have the rat trucks from my, uh, from my uh, glitch video not too long ago. That actually did pretty well. Was, that did a lot better than, you know, I thought it was going to be. So, hopefully these videos do well as well. Yeah. But here we go. First looks at the Tigan. So like I said before, it reminds me of the Wagner, just off of its design. But I have seen this car in real life while this was um, delivering. Um, I don't know how to pronounce it or anything like that, but it does look pretty nice. So I'm going to make it based off of the car in real life. Uh, I can't remember the name right now, but... I will put a link in the description if you want to check that out. You know, see if you are interested in any of their cars. So, stock impressions. It says solid. Now let's see how it turns here. Oh, I'm not even going to figure that out. Because all these cars in the way. Alright. Let's see how it weaves. It weaves pretty good. Alright. Keep crashing. I'm not the best racer. I got another <laughs> Corvette. All right. So here we go. We're gonna see the first impressions of the Tigan. Um, I like to customize. I like to customize the car. Okay. <laughs> Little glitch there. That right, repair. Armor, of course. Brakes, of course. Bumpers. All right, here we go. Canards. Okay. Then we got an extension here. It's called the race splitter. Then it splits here. The downforce splitter. You see the difference there. The two. Oh, that split as well. I didn't notice that. Okay. So then we got a performance splitter, arc splitter, and GT splitter. Hmm. Interesting. Um, I don't like that. I might put the canards on. I'm gonna put the canards on. Yeah. Put the canards on on like the extensions of the lips. Okay, race diffuser. Looks pretty solid. <laughs> and then a little fins in there. Performance splitter, speed diffuser. Oh, I said splitter. Oops. Performance diffuser, speed diffuser, and then turbo diffuser. So this is interesting. Hmm. I might do the race diffuser. I do like my cars to stay clean, you know? I like them to be clean with nice outlines, things like that. So, actually, hmm. I want the extension of the lip in the back, actually. Hmm. But I like this one. I'm gonna do this one. Okay. I'm not going to hurt my brain over it. I only have a few chromosomes. Alright, so we got a max engine upgrade. That is a nice exhaust, though. It's, uh, it's interesting. Reminds me of the Senna. It's not the Senna, though. Alright, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so that's interesting. I like this one. This exhaust option, I believe, is also on the Furia. Hmm. So you want a gaping hole, <laughs> or do we want something else? I want. I think I'm gonna do the, the Fury exhaust. Okay, horns. There's no new horns. I don't care about horns. 
Okay, I got some headlights, put those on. Livers. Here we go. So we got a stripe. Stripe. So, oh my goodness. That's, huh. That's kind of interesting. Okay, lime green. If you could have this, have the roof one color along with the primary as one color, that's awesome. Okay, so we got race four. Okay, then race, racer 10. Okay, racer 23. I don't know what these are referring to at all. I'll find anything out, I'll link it in the description as well. So, Jackal Racing, Sprint, Sprint, Flames, and that's everything. I ain't putting the liveries on this, because I don't like any of them. Well, again, don't have any custom plates, so I'm just going to put that plate on, respray. So, the one in real life was like a red, so I'm going to put like a wine, find the like a wine red, where are reds? Red, 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 here we go. I need a dark red. Dark red. Oh, yeah. Ooh, what if I, like, did this red? And... Oh, my God. Did they update the candy red? Or am I tripping? Candy red looks crazy. That's going on the Furio. <laughs> Alright, anyway. So, garnet red, alright, with a pearlescent... Ooh. Ooh, yeah, that's that's the <laughs> that's going on there. Mhm, mm that's nice. I didn't even look at anything else. All right, metallic. Let's see here. Oh, we can. Awesome. 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 Okay, love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Where is my the red that I put on? I put the I think I put this one on. Yeah. Okay. All right. If you want to sell it, you can get it sold for about one point four. <clears throat> Skirts, skirts. I like the little little lip there. Okay. Oh, even better. Ooh, this is this is a different uh, splitter or skirt. I'm getting tongue tied, and messing up. This is a different skirt than um, any other car that we have in the game. Pretty sure. If you know a car that has this uh, skirt, let me know in the comments. You know. Yeah, that's definitely going on there. Spoilers now. Here we get interesting. Okay, we got a primary race spoiler, secondary track, GT, carbon. Mm. Mm. Oh my gosh, this is. That's some crazy spoiler options. You don't see these spoiler options on any other car. If this spoiler was on the. Some of that we have in game, that'd be really nice. I'm gonna take the spoiler off the second this video is over, but for the sake of this oh, video, I'm just gonna throw on a little spoiler here so we have that extra traction for this video. Sun strips, I don't like sun strips, and I don't even like these. Suspension, drop. Okay, looks really good. Right. Yeah, definitely gonna be dropped. Transmission, turbo, of course, of course. These stock rims are sexy. Okay. Let's see if we like any of the street. <laughs> if you like any of the street options for this car, we don't. I don't like the new rims. I don't. Y'all can hate on me in the comments. I'm sorry. I don't like it. If we have any, it's probably in tuners. You know, if we have like little holes, and then I can make that like a chrome. Or not a chrome, like a like a gold. Like gold rims on this, I think would look really nice. And you guys might be able to see what I'm envisioning in this video. See, I want holes like this on the car. On the on the rims for the car. They're somewhere here. I'm not tripping. I've seen them before. These would probably look really good. In gold. Or bronze or whatever. I'm gonna check it. I'm not putting off those on here. I'm not even gonna check. Okay. Mm. Are they SUVs? Um. I don't know where they are. Okay. Anyway, so we're gonna do these rims. Wheel color. Uh, I was thinking like a gold, okay, or a bronze. Mm, that doesn't look like I wanted. 
That's not... I was envisioning something, and it's not what I expected. Mm -mm. That's unfortunate. Let me zoom out a little bit. Mm, it still looks good. In my opinion. It's my car. Screw y'all. <laughs> Alright, so, designs... Okay. Yeah, it looks good, but... No. So I'm gonna experiment with this a little bit, but... You know, don't want the video to be too long. So, now we are going to drive it. Alright, so maxed out, Tybin. That's, that was what it's called, right? Tybin. Okay. So, let's see what it does. Now, I was expecting Wagner performance. Because it looks like it. Okay. That's a pretty good top speed, actually. That's a pretty good top speed. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It does pretty nice. It does really nice. Let's see how it turns. Hmm. Okay. Let's see how it turns one more time. I hate NPCs so much, but it does drive pretty nice. It does drive pretty nice. Let's stop disrespecting the car. It looks really good. Actually, I like these rims. These rims look pretty good on here. All right. Oh, I didn't even know. I didn't even know. It has gold wing doors. Oh, oh my God. Okay, that just makes it a nine out of ten. All right, here we go. So I'm gonna open up all the doors here to see what opens up. All right. So the front does not open. Interesting. All right, but let's see what else. Let's see this engine bay. This engine bay is nice. The detail. Detail. Oh. Yes. That looks good. That exhaust looks good as well. Let's see the interior. Interior looks great. I don't think this interior is on any other car in game. Let me know in the comments. This is sticky. No, I'm tripping. But it does look really nice. That is sexy, Justin. That looks good. Alright. That's my brother, if y'all didn't know. He's a nice, he's a nice guy. If you want to see out his channel, link will be in the description. But, this is the Tybin, guys. Let's see how it competes with another supercar in game. So, me and him are going to drive to the airport. And we will see y'all over there all right let's see how it goes against a top-end supercar okay so this is a supercar so keep in mind that you will have to compete with the Krieger and Emirates okay? Krieger Emirates and WC8 so here we go we got an oppressor if that man even thinks about shooting a missile it's gonna turn into a PvP video but It does a double clutch? Let's see if it does a double clutch. It does. Okay. Interesting. So that means it's rear wheel drive, the way I just did it. So let's just make sure. Uh, try it over here. Okay. And it's, a, it's a nice car, really. And like I said, it would, in my opinion, looks a lot better without the spoiler. So I'm going to be taking that off. I do like the rims as well, but I might put the stocks back on. Because the stocks did look really nice in my opinion. Especially since they're chrome. And it's a nice chrome. You know, it's a very shiny chrome. So. We'll be checking that out later. But in the meantime, we're just going to wait for Justin to get his Emirates. His Emirates. And uh, we'll see how this car drives against a top-end supercar. Yeah. And the Emirates is actually, like, number one in the class. So, we'll see. He copied, uh, he tried to copy my design, but... There we go. So that's his Emirates. Let me know if you want to see our customization videos. Or, sorry, our garage tour videos. We have a lot of cars, so... We have a little obsession. 
Alright. Nice little simple drag race. You know, grenade test on the... The runway. You can't use explosives with this car. You're kidding. And for those that are tripping, I have grenades. This car does not allow you to have grenades. Or any other explosive throwables. Wow. Wow. So that's something to keep in mind. Alright, Justin, you're going to have to throw the grenade. Alright? You suck. Just buy grenades. They're like five grand. Buy them through the interaction menu. <laughs> Alright. So he's throwing a pipe bomb, so here we go. No rev, here we go. I think I started a little early, but Emerus is catching up. Alright. So do keep in mind that the Emerus does have a higher top speed. And that would mean the Krieger has a higher top speed as well, because the Krieger is around the same speed as the Emerus, if not a little faster. Alright. So we're going to try it one more time. We're going to, so with these tests, we do it like three times to see how well they compete. All right. So you're out of pipe bombs. Okay. Well, let's see if I can throw a flare. Oh, okay. He's shooting a flare. So once, so rev. So touch the ground. Here we go. So with rev, Emerus again is faster, you know? Emerus probably turns better as well. So, with this price tag, it's interesting. So, it all comes down to if you want to buy it. I forget how much this car was. Let me check it one more time. Let me see here. Uh, how much was this car? This car is $2.3 million. Okay, so $2.3 million. Emerus is around the same price at 2.7 around the same price but the Emerus is 2.7 and then this is 2.3 and for what it is it actually it does it's not being spanked you know it's keeping up there with the Emerus so we'll see later on if this car is actually like competitive in racing things like that we're gonna have like a little live stream this weekend where we're just gonna do a lot of races and just fuck around in the game so we'll see what goes on with that but yeah the car does look good it's an interesting design like I said it's basically on par with the Wagner is what I was expecting uh, well so we'll see how this does you know later on but top end supercar spanks it pretty much it doesn't actually let me take it that back it doesn't spank it but it does have a good performance. It has it has decent performance at the end of the day. So, with that being said, it all comes down to if you want to buy it or not. And really, for a short answer, for me, no. <laughs> but if you like the design of the car, you know you got a lot of money in this game. If you saw the glitch video, you probably got enough money to purchase this car. It's very stylish. You know, I will be keeping it just of the look, just because of the looks, and it will be moved into the supercar garage. But thank y'all for watching. I do appreciate that you guys did click on my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys aren't interested in what I have to show you guys, please make sure to subscribe and like the video. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Anyway, peace and hope.